Hello, my fellow Cancers. Welcome to your full moon in Virgo reading, your love reading. So this is going to be all about exposures, reveals, secrets. So if you have any Virgo placements, you might be feeling this energy a little bit stronger than the other signs. But yeah, think of your person so we can tap into their energies. This is going to cover the dates of February 27th through March 12th because the new moon is March 13th. So yes, think of your person. We're going to see any secrets that they might, might be hiding from you. Anything that is to be revealed. That was a very sad shuffle. Okay. So spirit guides of cancer, let us know what we need to know about our person. Any secrets that need to be revealed about this person. Knight of Pentacles. Someone is, so pinnacle energy is the slowest moving energy in tarot. It's earth sign energy. Um, it's not as fast paced as the other energy. So I do think that someone, it, like someone's been thinking about you. You've been on someone's mind. I don't know if you work together. I don't know if you were married, if you were living together, if you had some sort of like shared home space together, but this is like home energy. You could have been really good friends you know, relationship energy, truly. So I feel like this person, you're still on their mind and I feel like they're thinking about making you an offering, but it's very slow moving. So let's see how they're currently feeling since this is the secret wanting to make you an offering. Wow, okay. 10 of cups in reverse and the tower of right. I feel like with 10 of cups, it's blah, 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 blah. 10 of cups in reverse. This is the opposite of happily ever after. This is the opposite of ha happy family energy, the opposite of things going super well. And then we have the tower, which is shit coming to a head. Everything just falling by the wayside. So I feel like this person feels like they lost you in some way. This person is feeling a loss, a lack of a happily ever after. And they're experiencing a tower moment right now where everything is kind of like going wrong around them, but it's all for something better to come in their place, in its place. But I think there's a lot of crazy energies around this person right now, which might be why this energy is so slow going. What are their true intentions, spirit? Cancer's person's true intentions. Wow. So we have Ace of Swords and Knight of Swords. Heavy Swords energy in here. Also water energy. There's all sorts of energies in here, but this is the energy of coming forward towards someone. You are at the very least, if in the next two weeks they don't contact you, you are at the very least on their mind, 1000% on their mind. Um, what's the other tea that needs to be spilled? This person definitely wants to come forward and talk to you. Come on now, reconciliation after we just past the ace of swords and knight of swords yeah and the tower moment this person wants a new beginning with you cancer travel yeah this person wants to move towards you especially with knight of swords in here we have two knights in here this person's definitely thinking about getting closer to you in some way this person wants to move closer towards you cancer so Let's see through the romance deck what else needs to be exposed. What are the other secrets cancer persons needs to be that need to be revealed from romantic feelings? Come on. For this full moon in Virgo, let go of control issues. That could be this person too. Maybe that's why they're moving a little bit slower. Um, anything else? Children. This person could want kids with you, and there is that energy in here of Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups, family, kids energy, children. I feel like at the very least, this person wants to like have fun with you, play with you again, Cancer, but for whatever reason, I think this is them letting go of control issues. I think that's what they have to work on, and maybe that's the tower moment they're having. In some way, control is affecting their life and the fact that they love control. I feel like, yeah, it's, they need to control that in some way. Control your control. All right. What else is going on with Cancer's person? What are the other secrets that need to be revealed? Spirit, what else needs to be revealed with ca Cancer's person during this full moon in Virgo? What does Cancer need to know? Thank you. Yep, this person's definitely still thinking about you, or us, I should say. So we have spiritual lesson, which makes a lot of sense with the tower. The tower is all about enlightenment. It's like crown chakra is getting blown off here, roof chakra. So it's like your, your mind, especially with the ace of swords, this person's going through an awakening, a spiritual lesson, and I feel like it's causing them to remember you in some way, reconciliation, past life love. 
I feel like this person is like, you're very heavy on their mind right now. All right, other exposures, other secret spirit. Wow. Confusion and guilt, man. Okay, this person is very, they could be dating someone. Maybe that's what's causing confusion. Um, they, yeah, they could be entangled in another relationship. Maybe that's why they're having this tower moment. They're like, what side do I choose? And that could be why they're feeling guilty too. They could also be feeling just like confused in general about um, how much they like you and the fact that you're not together. And also the spiritual lesson could be bringing up some guilt, some shadow work for them. So I feel like this person's really going through a lot right now. Maybe that's why they have not reached out to you yet. I think there's a like a big storm coming this person's way. Like I think they're already going through it. Any other reveals you want to let us know? Thank you. Wishing. That makes a lot of sense. Ace of Swords, wishing energy, Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, reconciliation. This person is wishing you were in their reality again, most definitely. Final messages for Cancer about their person, what's going on, reveals for this full moon in Virgo. Final messages for Cancer. Cancer's person. I hear shuffle once, cut twice. You're not getting off that easy. Okay. Shuffling once, cutting twice. Other reveals for Cancer. Cancer's person during this full moon in Virgo. What do we need to know? Release. Okay. I think this person's doing a lot of shadow work with release coming out. It's like let go energy. Oh, this person's very attracted to you sexually, physically, sacral chakra. It's interesting, too, because guilt is kind of uh, the flip side of the sacral chakra. This could have had something to do with sex, too, with uh, our womb center. But this is definitely, this person is, uh, <laughs> I almost hear, too, like they're still getting off. They're still releasing about you, like thinking about you physically, sexually, past life love. It's causing them a lot of confusion. Guilt, yeah, this person's going through a lot. I think as they release, as they do the shadow work, a lot is coming up for them, a lot of guilty feelings. So, yeah, I, I do think this person's coming towards you. I think this person's going to end up saying something to you. It might not be in the next two weeks, but it's, it's heavy on their mind. If they're not going to do it, they're heavily thinking about it, heavily thinking about tra traveling towards you. So do keep that in mind, Cancer. I hope this resonated with you. Um, this person's definitely still attracted to you. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you in the new moon reading on March 13th.